RegTech, I think, is really important at the moment because of the pressures on the banks from competition and profitability and the current costs of compliance are probably not sustainable. RegTech essentially is about reducing the cost of compliance. There's no suggestion that, that the banks aren't compliant. They've been pretty good at it over the years, but it's expensive. Um, and with the pressure on the banks and their profits these days, the requirement to reduce the cost of compliance is becoming paramount. And, and RegTech is all about that. So I, I guess there's two aspects of, of RegTech. First is there's a raft of new regulations that are, are due to hit pretty quickly, things like MIFID II coming into effect January next year. The data gathering and processing requirement for, even if it's just the trade reporting aspect of it, is, is vast. So trying to understand you know, out of the you know, 60 to 80 data points that the banks have to gather, which ones are, are most difficult for them and how, we, how can we help them address those? RegTech is, is not just about new regulations, it's about uh, you know, the, the vast expense of compliance today and how we can drive down the cost of that. So it's understanding how they do things today and how we can implement new systems um, and, and kind of scale those systems so that it makes that whole thing less onerous. The average global bank has got 160 different regulations to comply to. A lot of those uh, compliance uh, requirements uh, depend on similar data sources and, and similar outputs. So if we can start to consolidate some of those efforts then, and, and automate those tasks, then we can dramatically drive down the cost of, of delivering um, those, those requirements and, and probably shorten the, um, the duration of, of the work as well. Most of the banks have been looking at this for some time, but might not have been under the, uh, the umbrella of RegTech, but, but they've been thinking about how can they reduce the cost of compliance. Um, and some of them have already gone through the process of you know, working out that they need to extract data from traditional systems and, uh, and transform it in such a way that it can work in, in new style fast systems like Hadoop and so on. For the new regulations, of course, there's, um, there's, a, there's time pressure. Um, you know, there's, there's a milestone that they're about to reach. They've got to be compliant by a certain date. And that, that kind of helps us both, I think. It helps kind of focus the, the attention um, and uh, it probably frees up some budget so that we can get the work done and, and obviously it focuses our resources to meet that, that particular timeline.